Hello, St. Bernard community. My name is Timothy Barker. I'm the seventh grade homeroom teacher and fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth grade science teacher. I also teach the seventh grade religion. What we're gonna be doing today is taking a tour of my classroom so you get a better idea of what we do on a regular basis in science. Here's what it will look like if you're walking into my classroom. So it looks like this right now because we are in a pandemic. So we're trying to make sure we're keeping our students safe and protected. Um, on the desk right now, you will see some eighth grade Adam projects. As we like to um, really put into practice what we preach, we like to bring to life what we're learning in the classroom. And so this is, these are some of the projects that the eighth graders have submitted. Um, and they do always a great and fantastic job. The first thing that I have all my students in fifth through eighth grade learn is the scientific method. This is the basis of all science. There is nothing more that we could learn from science if we didn't know the scientific method. Very, very, very important that we learn this in the beginning of the year before we jump into the individual topics. Over here to the right hand side of my classroom, you will see different posters that highlight the different things that the uh, students learn in science. Eighth grade tends to focus on the physical science and we learn about atoms, we learn about the elements, and we even jump into a little bit of physics as well. Over here, as you can see, seventh grade learns about life science and we, so we learn about the cell, we learn about the cell cycle, and we even get into something more minute and we learn about DNA, right there, DNA in the nucleus. In sixth grade, we learn about the earth, and we learn about different types of rocks, and we learn about layers of the earth, and, if we, and then we really get into volcanoes and earthquakes and how our earth really works. Here are some projects that I've collected over the years that eighth graders, seventh graders, and even sixth graders have, cre have created, and we even have our friend Mr. Bones, who is properly masked up because the science shows that if we wear masks, we can save lives. As I've discussed, I teach seventh grade religion. Here's our prayer table with a bust of Pope John Paul II. We have a bobblehead Pope Francis. We even have a bobblehead Jesus. We also focus a lot on Mary and how important she is to our faith and how we honor her. And at the center of all of that is the cross. The video. Mr. Barker is a really fun teacher. When he does his experiment, they all work and they're actually really cool. I like this one experiment where he had a water bottle and he put some like soap in it and it really, it just like with bubbles. It was cool. Hi, my name is Max Rado. I am in eighth grade and the reason I like science is the solar system. When it comes to science, my favorite thing to talk about is the solar system. I love planets, and I really like to talk about planets. And when we were learning about the solar system in science, Mr. Barker really made science class fun. Not only is he funny, that makes science class more fun, but for people that really don't understand it, he makes it easier to understand. And I really think that's cool for him. So Mr. Barker, all I have to say is thank you for making science fun. My name is Lauren Ortega. I am in fifth grade. What I like about Mr. Barker's class is we get to learn about how our body works and different organs in our body. Science is a good class if you want to be a veterinarian. I know this because when you're a veterinarian, you might have to look inside an animal's body. Science is a good way to keep your mind going. That is why I like science. The reason why I like in, I like your class is because, and why I love learning science in your class is because you're so engaging when it comes to all of your topics in science. Like, uh, I can get a good idea of it that will will make me have it for the rest of my life. Hi, my name is Anandi Girl and I'm in sixth grade. So the reason why I love Mr. Barker's class is because it's fun and entertaining, so I'm more focused. Now what I love about science is, is that I get to do these small fun projects and um, for example, I made this one project 
where they're salt crystals and I, I mixed water and salt and I left it out for the sun for three days and they turned to these awesome big salt crystals. My name is Ashley Asensio and I'm in the sixth grade. Here's one reason why I love Mr. Barker's science class. I love Mr. Barker's science class because Mr. Barker is always trying to find new, fun, and entertaining ways to teach us our science. Hello, my name is Malia Go, and I'm in eighth grade. I love science a lot since it'll help me in the future since I do want to be somewhere in the medical field. Mr. Barker's science class is always super fun since he's so enthusiastic and makes it very exciting to go into. I'm Nana Cooney and I'm in eighth grade. So the reason I really enjoy Mr. Barker's science classes is because he's he does a really great job of um, presenting information to us and he's really, really, really good at making sure that we really understand our information. He makes slideshows and he always presents it to us and he lets us take our notes and stuff and he gives us really great opportunities to review and just comprehend all the information that he's, getting, that he's like giving to us. Well, I hope you enjoyed the tour of my classroom and I hope you learned a little bit more about what we learned about in science. If you have any questions, don't be afraid to ask because even Einstein asked questions.